Fires now have a wildfire in Deer Creek Canyon 100% contained, and that means evacuations have been lifted for surrounding neighborhoods in Jefferson County. First showed you this fire last night is breaking news at 5, and now investigators believe two juveniles might be responsible. Fire broke out Tuesday, Thursday afternoon at the mouth of Deer Creek Canyon. That's west of Chatfield Reservoir. Rick Salinger live there now, and Rick, no rest so far? No, Dominic, it's not clear what these two juveniles were doing around the time that the fire broke out, but residents now back in their homes are grateful. It didn't turn out much worse. As fire crews mopped up, investigators learned that the blaze was quite possibly started by teens. They said they saw two kids running from the area, so hopefully they catch them. Witnesses said they heard explosion, saw smoke, then juveniles running. The fire grew rapidly and led to the evacuation of hundreds of people. A lot of people who live up here and you're, you could be putting a lot of people out of their homes. Many of them expensive dwellings perched in the dramatic landscape of Deer Creek Canyon. By early afternoon, checkpoints were set up and residents allowed to return to their streets upon display of identification. Uh, be a little careful on Grizzly Drive. There is still some fire hoses out. They should have it blocked off though. The canyon was reopened to regular traffic, but three parks remain closed. No one was hurt, no structures lost. For those who live here, it could have been much worse. We can see that area there that got burned and, you know, anything could have happened. It could have gone off to another direction and it could have been scary. In the season without much fire, it was scary enough. A big factor was the weather, as you probably noticed when you got up and outside this morning. It was much cooler today, and the wind had shifted overnight, blowing this fire back on itself. Live near Deer Creek Canyon, Rick Salinger covering Colorado First. Yeah, great work by firefighters, Rick. Thank you.